Hello ladies and gentlemen, I, uh, here I am, back. I'm playing League of Legends and I'm going with me Chogat. And I almost got killed, but I survived. I just flashed over the wall. Well in this game I was trying to go top, but the Gazix or whatever his name is went top so I had to go mid. And uh, I think Chogat is way better at top, but Still, at the end of the game, you will see that Chogat mid is quite awesome to play. He really dominates his lane. Certainly uh, against Malzahar, I think it is. Yes, it's Malzahar. He uses so much sustain and his damage is so high. The only bad thing is that if you do 5 raptures, your mana is uh, low. Not really. Uh, empty but really low. Ah. Let's see if, uh, but I really need to be careful because any moment there can be a gank. If I push the lane so far. The tower here we go. The Rengar is trying to kill me, but he won't kill me. Just because of my high sustain. Yeah. I shouldn't be pushing so hard as I did there. I should rather focus on getting lost hits, not really pushing anything. But didn't die, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. You see, I, I try to poke Mozart as hard as I can. You might pick him up here, almost. I think he has like. Under a tall left or so. Might get him very soon. But if he is tower hugging so hard, I won't be able to kill him. Tower diving on level 6 is quite dangerous bit. And their jungler can come to gank me at any time. Yeah. You're to already get as much minions as I can. I really need to see us. There's no pressure on me. I can take it easy. Yeah. I think it was at 800, 800 kilo, 850, something like that. But. Yeah. There was already a lot of flame in my team. Because at the beginning of the game they invaded our jungle and stole red, so and I also got a kill. They killed Tristana, I think. Quite sex bit. Go and he is dead. Too easy. Shouldn't be pushing so hard on me. As I got my rapture, it will slow him so badly. And Lee Sin, yeah. Lee Sin just dominates him easily. Lee Sin is still one of the best junglers in my opinion. Yes, awesome ganks. It's just so dire. Only important thing when you are playing Chogat Miss is that you uh, hit your uh, your raptures because they cost a lot of mana. Yeah, and missing them is bad. You see, Rengar is ganking me a lot in this game it's because the lane is always pushed. Silly sin, but he goes away. And stole? No, they. He didn't stole anything. No idea where he is going. We have a ward here, so they knew he was coming. Ah, yeah, it's just to run. S still trying to deal some damage. But it won't be enough to kill any one of our team. 
And at the same moment I can push the tower, maybe destroy the tower. Not yet, but dealt a lot of damage to the tower. And that kinda can make a difference. If the tower is destroyed, it gives us some early gold and here we see I'm going to get a kill. We are getting chased by their jungler and their mid. And their Oh yeah. In, gets killed. I couldn't do anything about that. I wish I could, but the roll team was behind us, or at least four of them. I think, yeah. As you see, I am ahead with CS. I got about 20 more than Malzahar. <laughs> Mozart is actually quite good at mid, but it's kind of counter pick. Oh, Chogit is a counter pick of Mozart. Purple team has slain the dragon. But I haven't played Chogit in a while, and I usually never play mid, and now I totally own him at mid and get ahead of Mozart. Just deals no damage to me. Yeah. Other cool thing about Chugat is that you can do your ult and then you gain. Ult. You can do it up to six times and gives you about 100 max health each time you do it. Also depends on which level your ult is. And it deals true damage, so it doesn't matter if they have magic resistance or not. I just hit through it, and here I might get killed. No, I managed to survive there. It's a good thing to pick up the Catalyst Protector and then go for the Rod of Ages. Give me some, gives me some sustain and ability power at the same time. Rampage. Blue team's turret has been destroyed. Here I'm getting the tower very soon. Mozart can't do much against that. And Rengar is only about 50% of the time in, in his jungle. Mostly he's just ganking mid or top. There we go again, he tries to gank. But that also means he gets behind on level. But if he isn't enough in his jungle, yeah, dying. Even worse. Ow. Blue team's turret has been destroyed. Just need to do a few hits in the tower, and it would be enough. Here we see what is there. Pushing so hard the bot lane. They really want to push it, but there we have Lee Sin helping. Then the right guard also comes. And yeah, 3 for 1. That's not too bad. Here I get ganked. Malzahar is really behind this game. We are so bad. Trying to interrupt the dragon. He totally fails at that. 
Here we need to run. No, we don't. We have our bot lane waiting for us to help. I get away. Flashing over the wall. Trying to slow him down and deal some damage. Here it's time to run. They're coming with two guys. Their misfortune still gets high CS even though she gets shut down in her lane. Her stun is only ahead, thing. CS. Misfortune is good. Plus cheating at this game. I, I like the previous misfortune. Emblem or icon much better than this one. Looks like one of Diana. We know her name. Like the previous one better. They're playing extremely risky. But it is our advantage that I do that. We're just dealing so much damage. Her focus is quite amazing. Here yeah, I try to back off. Recall. But she interrupted me. Tower. At this point, uh, we are coming back. Yeah, please let me know if you like these kind of things, like full gameplays, full, full games of League of Legends. Bring it solo cues. Elo hell. Yeah, if you don't know what elo hell is, it's just basically that you are at low elo. Like elo is your ranking, the amount of points you have. You lose points when you lose a match. You gain points when you win a match. Usually there are a lot of trolls with this elo. And yeah. Someone is just feeding them and dying. There's really no way you can escape Elo Hell. Mm. Sure, Tristana playing quite nicely, escaping. Try to get Soraka. This fortune also easy kill. Your teammates are just coming too late. So they die as well. And that means we get a free Baron Nashor. Blue team has slain Baron Nashor. Nothing much. Fully bear can do right here. Team 
Team's turret has been destroyed. Should be defending a, their tower, but they prefer to go into the jungle. No idea why. Easy. Purple team's turret has been destroyed. A summoner has disconnected. Rage quits. Purple Team's inhibitor has been destroyed. At this point we were just waiting for the surrender. But they didn't give up yet. Just two minutes left and then it's over. Still managed to survive by the epic ultimate of Sona. She's the best stun I've ever seen. Saved my life. Madrid. Very good decision because they all go very Purple high health has been destroyed. and tanky. And yeah, here we easily get their Nexus. It just came too late. They're trying everything to stop us, but nothing has stopped us. There we go, GG. Alright guys, see you later.